close, no? Oh my gosh, it just started up. Are you looking, this is a thing? That's what happened outside and I'm gonna get frozen in. I'm not gonna make it. It's uh, Saturday, episode 4914. I'm here. I'm living. I'm trying to get the. What the? Hey, wait a minute. What is that jingle jang? You hear it? Some kind of jungle jungle? Hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again. Once a day, every day. Turn the machines and look. I'm alive. Here we go. I made it all the way back around here to Saturday. I don't know if it's snow or is it an effect. Kind of maybe both. I think it's like... um. The, if it is snow, it's only half e snow, and the effect makes it more snowy than it really is. So there is some snow mixed up in there with the rain, but it's mostly rain. Spain, you know, planes, trains kind of deal. Uh, the transatlantic, and then the rain in Spain falls mostly in the plane. Spain. I got pizza. Oh, what the heck? Some people on the street are calling people. Can I hear that? I hear, I hear the dial ringing. I wonder how the phone systems work. They went from cell phones to landlines. Everybody's got cell phones, but are they still going through the, the, the same kind of channels? This pizza has mortadella. I've seen it on TV. I'm pretty sure it's just ham. Um, I don't know the difference. This is mortadella. So, I'm gonna ask the pizza people. What is more to dealing with? It's ham! Oh, it's ham. All right. We can't call it ham. I'm going to call it pork. Everything's pork. It's pork! Uh, it's pretty good, though. Mortadella. Mortadella is thin. And it just kind of blends with the cheese and the other things. Hard to tell what's even there. Mm, it's good. Uh, I made back around here to Saturday. Yeah, I do like pizza. Yesterday was Friday. Friday night. Wow, hey, hey, today's Saturday. It's the weekend. It's kind of the evening and the weekend, though. Uh, kind of odd thing in the weekend. Like, I, uh, I'm working, you know, a regular job, but then when it gets into the evening, it's like the same as the day of other days, but it's the weekend! So, like, I kind of like sleep in until after I would have been working anyway, then what's the difference? Well, people are out. Old school was crowded. There was a baseball team there. Um, like kids playing baseball. It's a weird life. Um, yesterday I was here. I was eating. Uh, man, I don't even want to think about this, but I ate a um a Jimmy John sandwich and. It was kind of a bummer, <laughs> the sandwich was. It's like sad food, and I didn't like it. <laughs> That's like about the story. 
<laughs> food was bad and uh, could have gone without it. Uh, Kara got in here in the credits. Was it yesterday we were talking to Steve and Ben? Or was that two days ago? Leap day. It was on leap day. Yesterday was the first. Leap day was the day before that. We talked with Ben on leap day. I remember talking to him about it. So yesterday was not Ben. Was it Bird? Or was that the day before as well? All the days are blurring together. I was eating a sad sandwich, living, doing things. You know, after the program, doing regular things, sleeping. I'm not, I, I had to take a break from knitting because my hand is kind of messed up. I think I got, I got instantaneous carpal tunnel. I was going too hard at it. I'm on one, three, and two thirds through the sweater, so I gotta buck up and keep knitting. Maybe soon, sooner than later. Yeah, I'm sleeping on the weekend. Hey, it's the weekend. Went to stores. Went to. Pizza. Pizza is good. We got mortadella. Stores are good too. Regular stores. I don't even buy anything most of the time. I'm like a uh, going to the good one in the Valley Village, and it's like, oh, it's the weekend. I better do this and. I I have so much things and I inherited all of my grandmother's things and I've been collecting things every weekend basically keep going back to all these stores um, and I usually don't even buy anything so I'm just like driving around town in a loop and st stopping at a store might as well just like do like a mall walk people in the mall are like old people and they don't want to walk in the streets so they walk up the mall I don't know if that's still a thing there's a retirement center across the street from uh, mm, what's it called uh, the mall there's a retirement home there. I don't know if they went back to walking around the mall. But uh, I'm driving like across town to this Goodwill and then walking around. I guess I'm looking for a treasure. But now everything is so expensive. It's like, what could I possibly find? But uh, I was really for garage sale season. I'm walking around looking for junk. And then I... Uh, don't buy anything usually and then leave and then go to the other side of town and go to another one do the same thing walk around there so I'm literally like driving and walking around the store and then leaving rarely buying things this is my routine now but what am I gonna find I'm waiting for something I don't know what it is you know one of these days I'm gonna show up there It'll be something unfathomable. Unfathomable. Um, yeah, I won't be able to fathom whatever this thing is. And I'll get it and I'll you know, throw it in a bin. We moved out of my grandmother's house about a year, uh, more than a year ago. Around... Uh, I mean, we started moving around like probably November. No. Mm, yeah, mid November because um, at that house we were getting a carpet installed there. And uh, the carpet was installed while I had COVID. White man's virus. 
So, and that was Thanksgiving. So they installed the carpets a few days before Thanksgiving. And then I got COVID and then they installed the carpets. And then after that, I was able to move things in. So I have a pretty holiday oriented timeline. That was 20, must have been 22, right? What year is it now, 24? Wow, 24. We're a quarter of the way through. Well, actually at the end of March. Right now we're about two, we're two twelfths of six. We're about a sixth of the way through. And then after this, we're gonna be um, about a quarter of the way through. It doesn't really make sense. We're gonna be a fifth of the way through, I guess in the middle. In the middle between the middle of March, then we're gonna be a fifth of the way through the year. Right now we're a six, a sixth of the way. Six more of these two month periods. Then we're gonna be in 2025. Okay, here's some math. Um, you know, I think it's gradual enough that it's uh, the, the one day doesn't matter when I'm doing this math. It's Jane math. My grandma had a lot of things, and most of the stuff we just took, and I didn't even look at what it was, and lots of boxes and everything, and she already had boxes that have been um, boxed up in, like, at least since, like, the 80s or, you know, maybe even, like, the 60s, and you have all these boxes, and you're like, oh, look at all these things, and get all these things, buy your things or whatever it is, um, put them in the boxes, and then put them on the shelf until you die, like with her, I mean, literally, and now I have them, and I have my own boxes, going to all these stores, I'm not, like, gonna go to a, I'm actually get a, um, a storage unit, like, I don't want a storage unit, though, because I don't need any more storage, I have enough storage, I have a whole place, lots of stuff, but I want to go look at my things, but I like, guess I want to leave the house or something, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Look at the, like, a uh, 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 catalog, catalog the belongings, and see what what's there, and then what, take stock, and then what, and then what do you do after you have stock of it? Like, well, I did that. Uh, certain things, some things up and down, you know. I'm gonna get some more to Della. But I didn't really ever move, and I was, like, moved in around, like, officially, I think, we were finishing on New Year's Day. Is I think the first day we started sleeping there. And uh, New Year's Day 2022. So now it's been a year and a sixth of a year. And there's still lots of things laying around. I mean, once we were like settled in, in enough to like watch TV, I was like, that's enough. That's it. Here we go. Living. And now there's all these boxes of things and probably go through them and then, I'll, well, I'm sure there's better stuff in there anyway. I already bought it. It's like going to the thrift store, going to the store to find things, and there's already things that I already have. And it doesn't even leave the um, the, uh, the 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 car sometimes. I just threw off my car. I think when it's like a good thing for me. The cameras are picking up the snow more than I can even see it with my mind, with my eyes. I don't know what, how real it is. Well, we're getting down through this thing. We got some messages. We got a message. Somebody from Oregon. Hopefully it's not a jerk. I know because they're in the same area code as Mr. Ginsu. And it's not Mr. Ginsu, it's somebody else. And we'll see how this Oregon person is doing. I'm gonna check out the pass. My brother's at a casino. Maybe we'll see what's going on in the casino. Uh, go to, you know, do you want to go to the field? 
I didn't go to the casino, but I could have. What the heck? Now it's snowing. Now I can see it. Oh my god, am I gonna get stuck here? I mean, just gonna have to bail. Like right when the um, right when this program is over, I'm gonna go bail and try to get home because I don't want to get snowed and um. Well. I don't really have a great program set up at the house either. If I got like completely snowed, well, I'm gonna ride the bus. That's my plan. Well, if I'm snowed out of the house, I'm riding the bus down here. If I get, you know, COVID, and then I'm going to just do a low, uh, well, I mean, I guess it's maybe a high tech version of this one. Like doing like a webcam kind of deal. So that'll be okay. I mean, it's pretty much what the program looks like when we're in the basement in 2020, which I'm kind of going to wait till look at the 2020 tape because we're going to be in there pretty soon. Um, in the thick of it. Yeah. Like the beginning of April, it was a really far out time. I guess it's March now. I've been talking about this uh, kind of cursed. Oh my God. Oh no. I don't have any water and I parked kind of far away. I'm gonna drink like old, old drinks from the here. And David Liebelhart's drink. I've been sitting in here for ever. Liquid. It's a liquid. How much sugar is in this? Oh my god. This is the one I'm. I'm it comes down to. So I'm not gonna go get the water. It's far. It's kind of far. Might be able to make it. I don't know, is this good? Wow, I am gonna drink it. I'm gonna drink it. I'm not gonna get water. Let's we'll see if I die. Uh, I don't like this stuff actually. Maybe I should get the water. And I gotta set up a tape. I think I'll make it. I gotta cross the street to get it. Eh, eh this is okay. It's like, whoa! But I already started and it's already popped, so um, I just gotta remember to get the water. And next time, maybe the parking will be a little bit easier because it's kind of far away. It's crowded. I don't remember it being that crowded, even like anywhere. I think the world shut down, came back, everything's blowed up. And they're playing. Snowboarding movies at the BAMP Film Festival. So. Alright, here we go. Let's call my brother. program on TV, how are you? That's it. Every oh, bad. Oh, no, why? Oh, uh, I got robbed. Where? By a one-armed bandit. Yeah, what did you do? Did you fight them? Yeah. Did you have to get a fight? What, he's like, give me your money. No, I gave it all to the one arm bandit, I gave it all to it, and then uh, I said, fuck you. Hey, are you talking about the slots? Hey, don't call me a slut. Oh! <laughs> That's like beeps and buy a joke, right? I don't know. 
Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to score with the slots. <laughs> We're going to get some slots. Uh, i got to go play the slots. Um, you lost? The same thing. Yep. When I give the jar of All of it? I lost all my money. What are you going to do? Um, I don't know. Are you still there? No. You're back at the house? Yeah, well, um, I watched the uh, Albert Brooks movie a while ago. Um, and in the middle of it, uh, so they, it's a, a family and they decide to sell their life, their house, or whatever, and go on the road. And they buy like a motor home and then they travel the world, right? The country. Uh -huh. And then, uh, and then right when they get going, they go, they stop at a casino and the wife loses all their money. Yeah. And then they have to keep going. Yeah, and that's the whole, that's what the movie is. And they have to figure it out after that. Yeah. She got a gambling addiction. It was a twist in the middle of the movie. Yeah. Yep. I mean, it's like if you don't have enough money to live, and then you're, it's like you're hail mary or something. What's this thing about? Actually yeah, well, some people actually do spend all their money on gambling. Yep. And then what? Yeah. And then they don't have any money. And then they want to eat the food. The food's in the store. You can't buy the food. Yeah. Lots of food. Yeah, gambling is uh, dumb. You should just uh, not gamble and save your money and spend it on, yeah, food. Yeah, you know, there's a grocery store. The grocery store is full of food. Or you can go to the casino and give it all to them. Yeah. I mean, you're like, hey, can I have some of that food you got in there? I'm very hungry. And they're like, no, you have to pay for this. Okay, like, hey, your whole, your, there's a lot. You got a lot of food in there. Can I just have a little bit? Cause I'm hungry. Nope. No, you gotta get, you gotta get other people to buy it for you. <laughs> yeah, you, you don't even to, have to go in the store. You gotta get other people to buy it for you, or, or yeah. Um, you're just hungry. Probably enough food. I mean, that's awesome. You think there's enough food? Have you ever uh, been hungry and then instead of eating, you just didn't eat? Because you're lazy? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's the only reason I've ever been hungry. Because I'm lazy. You're too lazy true, to do anything about it. And then if you get too hungry, then you don't want to eat anyway, because then you don't want to get up. Yeah. Um, oh, but then you just... You, Wait, you go to sleep? What's that? Eh? You, what, what was the question? You ever been hungry, but you don't... You go to sleep? Eat. But you don't eat? But you don't eat? <laughs> Have you ever been hungry? That's the, I, that's the main reason I get hungry, I think. Because you didn't eat? Yeah. Well, have you ever just not eaten, skipped a meal? Or maybe a whole day? Um... Or uh, dinner. I'll just go with dinner. Have you ever had to have? Have you ever wanted dinner and then just said, "Oh fuck it, I'll eat tomorrow." Um, no, I usually eat dinner. I mean, I sometimes skip like breakfast and even lunch, but rarely. Yeah. Well, I guess that's how it would happen. What if you skip breakfast and lunch and then you got to dinner time and you said, "Oh fuck it." I don't think that would happen. I am pretty hungry. <laughs> And I eat here on the program. I have it set up so to eat. Oh, uh, yeah, that's good, actually. I almost have the opposite problem where I'm like, oh, I already ate a lot, but now I'm going to be here. I can't not eat. Uh -huh. Really, if anything, I'm eating too much. 
What the fuck? What? There's a, there's a backpack that looks funny because it takes the, the weight off your back and it looks like it's like floating. Where does, it, back. where does it put your weight, the weight of the bag? I don't know. I don't know how that works. Well, it's got to go somewhere. Yeah, it's got to go somewhere. No, this thing, you wear it, it defies gravity. Where all the, it takes all, the weight away. All the weight goes on your legs. Could go under your legs. You can still go. Uh, it's, it's, it's physics that forces it to stay straight, I guess. And then what? What does that help you with? How does that help? The weight. It somehow displaces the weight with like a track and weights or something. I don't know. Yeah, more weight? I don't know. I don't, I don't understand physics. So this guy's explaining it right now, though. I don't that think... Mark Rober guy. I'm going to show you how science works. You watching Shark Tank? No, it's on YouTube. Can you show that to Mark, the guy from Shark Tank? Exactly. Mark Rob, no, the guy that was on the Mr. Beast video, that, that YouTuber guy. Oh my god. Um, what the? Buy a backpack. Did you, so you went, you didn't go to the casino for very long. A minute, yeah, I just, I usually spend all the money and then I wait for my friend to be done. And today he didn't want to, he didn't wait, he didn't stay there very long. He was done early too? Yeah, he was done really quick, so I was like, alright, whatever. How, what happened to him? He just lost all his money as well? Yeah, I saw him, he won about $200 and then he spent above like 400 How much did he put into it? And relatedly, well, we weren't there that long, so he must have spent less. He probably put in, he probably won 200, but he put in like 300 or something. What is he? <laughs> why, why, why do you keep doing that? I think his mindset is if you don't win like a big, big jackpot, then you just keep going. I mean, what's the big one? Is it? That's craziness. Like a thousand. If I hit a hundred, I would, um, not put that back in or something. I think that's my strategy. I'm a lot. Yeah. Maybe too much. Um. I'm gonna queue up the message of the future. All right, bye. Wait, no, hold on. Get on the message of the future. Um. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Stop being a music cop. That's what I gotta say about the future. Never Don't go. Bye, cop. future. Get whipped cream. Lower water. That was All right. Um, uh, here it goes. Hey, <laughs> future's at the best. Hey, future. Remember when I spent all my money at the casino and now I don't have any more money? Mortadella. It's uh, Saturday. Is it half snowing? My future. It's snowing. It's like on and off. What's mortadella? Fancy bologna. It's bologna? Yeah. I got pizza, um, mortadella on this pizza. I don't think it's... It, it's it's ham. It seems to be fancy bologna from all the videos I watch. Oh. Well, it's good. Bologna pizza. All right, bye. All right, bye. Bologna pizza. Hey, how's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. Uh, call me back. My name is Joel. Five four one. Oh, 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 card, I, card. I wanted to be on TV. Hey, hey, how's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. Sorry, what? Uh, Hey, how's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. Your drawer? I don't know what this person's talking about. Let's take a look at these last couple of weeks and then we'll call this guy.
Mortadella. It's uh, Saturday. Is it half noon? Mortadella. We're going to go to sometime in February. It's going to take a while to get two weeks into March. About uh, 12 days. Here's Saturday. Monday the uh oh. Monday the twenty fifth, Sunday. Monday the twenty fourth. Oh, sorry. Last Wednesday. Okay. So seven days before the twenty fourth, twenty three, twenty two, twenty one, twenty fifteen. Saturday the fifteenth. Watch this go. What were we doing last Saturday on the fifteenth? I don't know. I actually don't remember much about it. We'll find out right here. Uh oh, it was the 16th. I did the math a little bit wrong. Hey, Joe's Pizza Timing Friday. Bye, Future. Bye. What's the past? Did you think you had a message when you didn't even have one in the past? Yeah, they had a biopic about you, remember, in like 2012, and they were going to make a documentary. Did that ever happen? How long is your bio, and how long are you going to shove your life into my future? Hey, future, touch the path. Hello, future. It's, uh, you didn't watch that movie, The Interest About the Holocaust? Um... Would, would oh my god, don't remind me. Did that person recover? What did it say the what? future? Say something in the future. Uh, ho uh, hello future. Oh, I hi. hope Dollar Tree prices go down. Hey future, just the past. Hey future, I hope that everyone is nice to Kenny. Please. John Heyman will see you down here very soon in hell, John Heyman. <laughs> future, it's us. The past. It is Tuesday. And I get the pizza. I'm trying to get over those movies. They're heavy. Uh, did you make it? Bye, future. I'm gonna make it a little heavy, too heavy. Future, it's us the path. What do you have to say, the future? Hey, future. Uh, I mean, Star's book. Uh, so, those reading the book. We got Far East. Our movie out of here. <laughs> the computer's not working too well. Uh, bye, future. Bye. That's the past. Look up, James. Get off that hey. thing. Hey. Oh, hey, future. How many arcades are there in town now? Say something the future, James. Hi. Hey, future. Things are looking up. Things are looking up. I don't know how things could get any better. James is here from the California. Bye. <laughs> I got kicked out of that house in Baltimore. Future, it's us, the past. It's <coughs> Friday, how's it tomorrow? Are you corn yet? Did you put away the rice? Did you make it? Did you eat Burger King? Uh, bye, Future, how's your uh, crop tunnel? Not good. Hey, Future, it's us, the past. Hey, Future. Hey, Future. John, what do you have to say? I hope Zoe got back safe from her night of partying last night. John, say something in the future. John. Yes. Bye, future. Future. It's also the past. You feel Lessons from history about violence and whose idea it is to do the thing. Did you refill your water jug? Uh, we got some new people calling. What's going on? This thing sounds great. 
Um, check it out, my future. Bye. Future. Hey. Hey, future. Hey. Kenny wants to tell you to smoke on some good old lemonade Kush. That Cali lemonade Kush. Oh. Selling it straight oh. out. Oh. Selling it straight out. The it's your legal right. It's that Monday. yellow Kush. What if the future? It's your legal right. I hope you go taller. How's the... Uh, Pizza, bye future. It was good. I hope everyone. Pizza was good today. Mortadella. Uh, just the time. Uh, mm -hmm. It's got a good it's, chew uh, to it. To the, the meat. Never wash. Remember before all those crimes? <laughs> What's the new one? Did you have a new one, future? Back here. When we, you know, we had so many, but there's only room for more. Bye future. Bye. Hey, future. I hope I get my job. Kenny really fucked up today by forgetting. I hope he doesn't forget again. Oh, my God. Thank you, future. Uh, we're going overtime, and Burb is on the phone eating meatballs. Bye, future. Meatballs. Empire, uh, food crew. Just the past, hello, 28, 32, 36, 40, 44, 48, 52, 56, 60, 64, 68, 72, 76, 80, 84, 90. Are you dead yet? What is your question? What do you have to say to the future? Are you sending a message to the future right now? Yeah, we're taping a message to the future. Every four years, is it Groundhog's Day? There's something to the future, Steve. Who's on the future? So this future leap day. The future leap day. Hey, uh, do you guys still have, um, do you guys still have, uh, the comics inside Bazooka Joe Gum? My future. It's just the past. Hello, the future. <laughs> what do you have to say to the future? We're up to the future. What do I have to say to the future? Big blessings, big love, um, good karma, and stop littering. Don't go to Jimmy dickhead. John's. Stop being a dickhead and stop being a music cop. That's never, what I got to say about the future. Never go. Bye, future. Get whipped cream. Good advice. Hey, Peter, remember when I spent all my money at the casino and now I don't have any more money? Yeah. Mortadella! It's uh, Saturday. Is it half snowing? My oh, oh, wow. Hey, all right. Well, that was uh, the past. Let's call this guy the the the... Hey, how's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. Uh, call me back. My name is, how's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. I don't know what it is this person saw. But I guess we'll find out. They called last night from Oregon. Oh, your show? I just saw your show? I just saw your card. I what is that word? Hello? Hello? I saw your card. I, I don't know what it is that they saw. I want to kind of hear this word again. What do you mean? Mated voice messaging system. Joel Phoenix. Is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. To leave a callback number, press 5. Hello, it's the program. Um, you called uh, yesterday, you said uh, this. How's it going? I just saw your card. I wanted to be on TV. What is it that you saw? You saw... Hey, how's it going? I just saw your shard. Hey, oh, hey Freddy, how are ya? I'm good, I'm good. I'm waiting for some slices at old school. Mm, I was just in there not too long ago. I actually just finished it. You gonna get the mortadella? Uh, I'm getting the pepperoni with broccoli. Mmm, pork. 
What is the what is the other one? I couldn't make it. I couldn't really figure it out. Mortadella. I mean, I had it. I, it's like some kind of ham. My brother says it's bologna. Oh, I see. Bologna. That's weird. I was talking about this earlier. I was saying if you could ask them what it is, and you can say what is, what's mortadella, and they're just gonna say it's pork. Oh yeah, everything's pork. That's like the official meat of pizza is pork. Mm-hmm. I've uh, given it up. I just I've uh, I can I can have uh, pork as long as it's on just on pizza. <laughs> yeah, pizzatarian. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, it was very crowded when I was in there. There was a kids' baseball team. Are they gone? Oh, no, it's not that crowded now. I mean, it, it, there's not really any spots to sit, but... What about the kids' baseball team? Oh, maybe team? that is... The, okay, that makes sense. No, there was a bunch of kids playing the video games, and, and maybe they were in, like, baseball outfits, but I just sort of thought it was, like, kids in, on TV outfit, you know? Like, that's what <laughs> kids look like. They're in baseball outfits. Oh, that's what kids look like. <laughs> yeah. Um, exactly. I wonder if they're playing baseball in this weather. Oh, it's snowing. Uh, yeah. It's always worth mentioning for the posterity of, um, you know, the future. Looking back, it's weird. It's snowing again. How much snow? Um, how well can you hear the messages? I wonder if you can hear this. Hey, how's it going? I just saw your card. I want. Can you hear that? I can hear it okay. It's a little like. I mean, it's not super clear. I can mostly make it out, though. I don't know what this guy's saying. It said so, that he what saw... What is he saying? It sounds like he's saying... Maybe, maybe he's saying, I saw your show, but it kind of sounds like he's saying, I saw your shard or card. Or, <laughs> or maybe... Card. Okay. It's possibly card. Let me see. You, know, you hear it again? Yeah, let me hear it again. Hey, how's it going? I just saw your shard. I wanted to be on TV. Did you hear that? Oh, what's going on? I just saw your chart, yeah. That's what it I sounds like, right? TV. He says he wants to be on TV, though. Yeah. So I already called him. We're actually... The maximum time oh, permitted we're leaving that guy a message right now, actually. Satisfied with the message, press 1 to listen to your... All right. Now they're gone. Wait, are you still there? Oh, uh, oh. Are you leaving me a message? No, we were leaving... That guy with the shard voice a message this whole time. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, so he'll hearing that, he'll be hearing uh, about old school pizza. Yeah, you didn't get the mortadella yeah. though? I didn't get, oh no, I didn't. I mean, it sounded like, yeah, shard. Card? Maybe a card. What about like a business card? It's potential, potentially you got a, you saw a card. Again, he said he wants to be on TV. Isn't that what the card says? Yeah, it says that. The cards are right in front of you. I have them. I have some in my pocket as well. Oh, good. Yeah, what does it say on there? Why do you have him call the number to be on TV? Yeah. Nice. Could, could be nice the card. Working. Could be the card. I think it has to be the card. Because shard, that doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, and then it's too far from show. It's not show. It can be show. Yeah, I didn't say show. Yeah, I think it's We'll go card. We're going card. card. So they saw the cards. The cards are out there, and they don't know wow. what's going to happen. Huh? I'm. I wonder how they get a card. Like, where are they? Are they at old school? They used to be, didn't they? Oh yeah, maybe they're here. Yeah, put a couple on the... We should, I guess we should put them more places. The thing is, we have so many VHS to make the cards out of that uh, we probably should make more and just, like, throw them in the street, basically. Yeah. Because we're... The, the, whole, the whole studio is filling up. Oh, I got some more tapes. I got some, like, um, Disney VHS tapes. Uh, it's all the sequels to every Disney movie, like Beauty and the Beast 2... Aladdin to, um, oh. like, uh, Charlotte's Web to, like, everything where it's like, this probably shouldn't have made. Yeah. Is it, is uh, it really Charlotte's Web yeah. too? Yeah, and Pocahontas too. Pocahontas? I mean, I mean, I don't know. I don't think Pocahontas is a movie. I don't think I ever saw it, but it's, like, somewhat historical. Oh, right, because she goes to Europe or something. 
Yeah, I don't know. I never saw that movie. I don't think it works out. I mean, that that one particularly, they really made it seem like everything was uh, fine. And I think the real story of Pocahontas is like horribly sad. Yeah, but is the sequel like Pocahontas? Like the the first movie is like John Smith in the woods, and the second movie is like Pocahontas in Europe or something. Yeah, something like that. We're in Charlotte's Web. Doesn't uh, everybody die at the end of the first one? Well, Charlotte does. I don't think everybody does. I, I think Char- somehow oh. the the like the whole thing is that I think Wilbur was going to get eaten, but then because Charlotte makes it seem like the pig can spell or something. Um, mm-hmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> they're like, oh, we can't eat this pig. He's a genius. Seems like he could, um, uh, 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 I thought he was get eaten. That's like, you know, there's a trope in movies where, babe, like, you know, Rugrats, the show Rugrats? Yeah, I've seen that show. You know, like, all the babies, they can communicate with each other. Right, yeah. And, like, yeah. in, in movie, other movies, like, the animals can communicate with each other? All the animals, yeah, it doesn't matter what species, they all talk together. And it's like, it's like another language. It's like it's it's yeah. not like but for some reason they can't speak English, but they're speaking their own baby or dog language. Do you think it's psychic? It's supposed to be. I mean, they have, like move their mouths and stuff, but I wonder if it's supposed to be some sort of like psychic communication. Yeah, but what about yeah all their coordination? It's like these babies are really seem to be coordinating their uh, movements somehow. Yeah, it's like they have a language. Yeah. I guess we would see that more often if it was happening in real life. Or in like, like Charlotte. Charlotte could make the letters in the web, but and like, we're, yeah. How did Charlotte learn how to spell? That's my question. Yeah, how did Charlotte learn how to spell? And and how can Charlotte should have just said, "Don't eat pigs. They can talk." <laughs> like all of them. <laughs> yeah. You know? Like, oh, I think I got my pizza. Oh, with the broccoli. Oh wait, maybe not. What did they say? I'm not sure which one they said. Is it your pizza? Oh yeah, not for me. Bummer. Uh, I gotta keep waiting. Name that ends with a Y or like a I E. So. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm gonna prepare for episode five thousand. And TCTV. Yeah, gotta, oh, shoot. we got to go to the Capitol Theater. Who do we talk to? i got to talk to the Capitol Theater guy. Remember the guy we gave the award to? Maybe we'll talk to him. Yeah, maybe that or maybe just TCTV again. That would be kind of nice. I mean, I feel like I've got some weird news about TCTV, actually. So. Oh, what? Um, well, okay. I saw in this email, you know, like the armory, where yeah. the city bought the armory or got the armory, yeah, and they're turning it into an art center. Mm. Well, um, they're they got all these like partners, uh, like non, and one of them on the list in the email was TCTV. I'm mm. like, whoa, what's that about? Are they going to move there? And then there was like a couple other like media based ones, um. And that's sometime in next, maybe like 2025 or something like that. But then um, that's also the year when their lease is up on the building that CCTV is currently in. And so it might move to like a smaller place. And that's just theoretical? Theoretical, but they're definitely one of the partnered organizations. And then Deb was saying something about yeah, I don't know, something. Oh, yeah, Deb, I think this might be secret, but I think Deb, like, is maybe going to retire. But then who else is going to run TV? is a good question. Yeah. Um, you should do it. <laughs> Me? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I have, it'd be, it'd be something to do. Yeah. It'd be a, a, a good career. Maybe not, probably not, actually. Wow. Yeah, sounds intense. Yeah. Um, like taking over a, a thing that 
is like not maybe doing great and then <laughs> yeah. I have no business experience and then um, and then I also don't really have any ideas on how to make it better other than like I think my ideas would all make it kind of like worse in, in, <laughs> yeah, the, in the eyes of everyone else probably yeah but it'd be fun or maybe maybe uh, Dan Bennett yeah we got to get him back on my show or at least check in. Yeah. For 5000 I'm going to call everybody. Yeah. I wonder. Uh... Oh, yeah. I got to get Lewis up here. Yeah. For 5000 We probably at least ought to go. I think we should just go to TCTV right now. Okay. That's a good idea. Um, maybe we can, like, if we are scheduling this far ahead, maybe we can get a live, have that be live on the air. Yeah, and we could um, figure it out. Do you have the calendars? Not with me. Somewhere, though, and then we can actually look at the date. Mm, yeah, that's a good idea. I remember it was, like, on a holiday or something, right? It's in May, I think. May. May holidays? Cinco de Mayo? Well, maybe... Is it on Cinco de Mayo? Maybe. If it's, I mean, that's only May holidays. Is there any other May holidays? Uh, can't think of any. Mm. I remember looking at the day and being like, "Oh, that's a convenient day." May. But I don't remember. May fourth. Mm. Yeah, May the fourth is not a real holiday. It's an, but it's a holiday. It's enough of a holiday to register as a possible holiday in your mind. Yeah, I, that's true, but I think that it was the kind of holiday where you might have work off. Is there even, is there, what is Memorial Day? Oh, here comes more slices. I'm excited, I'm hungry. Is, is Memorial Day in, in May? Yes. So maybe That's it's Memorial it. Day? May Memorial Day. May more is that, is that what remember. it is? Uh I don't know, I'm not looking at a calendar. I'm just sort of guessing. That's good. That would make sense. What do you which one is Memorial Day? That's Veterans as well? Spring? Are you talking to me or are you talking to someone else? Me? The the viewers yeah i don't know i guess i'm talking to you i'm i don't know who i'm talking to um <laughs> i'm talking to anybody who's listening who would possibly listen um but if you didn't answer i was gonna answer myself and try to think about it but i think that may are you talking to me the guy you're on the phone with Is that who you're talking to <laughs> i talk i mean, i was Sorry, talking to myself yeah i was talking to myself for like at least like uh, you know almost 40 minutes before you answered the phone yeah. <laughs> um, oh, man. I thought, I've been rambling. Somebody told me, or I was like rambling for like 10 minutes, and someone's like, I didn't, even, like, uh, I haven't said anything in like 10 minutes. It's been like going off on hamburgers or something. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, why? Oh, why, what happened? I, like, started. Was someone else there? Or, you mean this happened in real life? It happened in real life. Like, I was, uh, I was like hanging out, and then. Somebody's like, you've been talking just like straight for 10 minutes without stopping. <laughs> like, oh, what, what, wow. what's, going on? <laughs> what's going on? Yeah. Um, <laughs> it was maybe by hamburgers. But um, I think Memorial Day is the dead is for dead people. Oh, yeah, definitely. Memorial, yeah, it's like it's, the people who died in war. Oh, they died in the war and then veterans made it back? Veterans Day... Yeah. Veterans Day is for people who made it back, and then Memorial Day. Which is interesting that they didn't just combine that into like uh, a overall day, like holiday. An Army Day. Army Day. And you can still be. Oh, I think that's fine. When people are alive, they still get to do uh. Memorial Day. 
Broccoli. Yeah. No, I'm not. They didn't get it yet. I, I think when I got here, I was like the second person in line, and I was like, ooh, this would be great. It's a quick slice, but I think maybe I had just arrived at the end of like a huge busy time. Yeah. So I think I'm having to wait. They were really backed up when I was there earlier. Um, I think there's a lot of people yeah. there. And this th- might not have been the best idea. I was like feeling hungry, and I just wanted to slice. I didn't want to go home and cook. But, well, um, I would, you know, I could have maybe been home. Yeah, but you, are you in a hurry though? You, it's uh. I guess I'm not in a hurry. I wasn't in a hurry either. I was, I was th- kind of thinking the same thing. I was sitting there. I, I was there probably like 40 minutes. I was like, this is kind of a long time. But what else am I going to do? I guess what I'm thinking is, I wish I had a quarter. Mm, you could get. They probably give you like, one. Oh yeah, I don't have any anything at all. Now it's kind of late for it. They got the games down there. Arcade games are weird now with the arcade downstairs. Now I'm like, oh, arcade games. Uh. Yeah, one of the one of the multi kid games is one of the games that's in the like actually in the arcade as the official game. I was like, oh, well, that's weird. <clears throat> Which one? Burger time. They got burger time in the multi arcade at old school. Yeah. Mm. Which is cool. I really like burger time, but it's very hard. Like it is. I would say impossible, probably. Can you play the... I, I've never got past the third level. Oh, I just heard my name. Hey, that's Thank good. Thank God. Well, the show's Peace about over. We've only got about three minutes left. Oh, okay. What are we going to do for the last three minutes? Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, they, they're, they're, that, they're really big slices. Mm, yeah, it's up and down. I was just kind of thinking about maybe what we did all the day. I was thinking about Mortadella quite oh, a bit yeah. earlier. Huh? What? Remember, I was I, I, I like to think about what I did all the whole as I've been sitting here. Oh, and it's March. Yes. We're we're gonna be getting into um. I, I wonder. Death week and spaghetti oh, week is. Oh, that's a lot of garlic. Yeah, the 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 minced garlic. I had that one. They got the um. We got the spaghetti tape. Did we do a death week tape? We might not have done a death week tape. Cause the spaghetti week tape is on there. For Spaghetti Week. Uh, I mean, it seems like if we were really smart, we would have done a tape that had both. We could uh, do it this year because the Spaghetti the spaghetti Week tape is still there. Oh, yeah. I kind of want to redo the whole thing, though. Maybe it's time. It's been like four years, basically. Yeah, we definitely need it before episode 5,000. Yeah, update the thing. Like, I wonder if we... Yeah. Maybe we should. Should we make it and then reveal it on episode four thousand? Episode five thousand. Five thousand. What is beeping? Yeah. I'm hearing beeping. Um, it's, uh, I'm walking back to my car. Your car's beeping though. No, no, that's like the thing when you're the crosswalk. Oh, okay. It's like, hey, go. Supposedly it's for blind people or something. Like I think it beeps. Oh yeah. When did they, you know, they used to say, like, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, he like, keeps telling you to wait. I'm like, do this? probably says wait even if no one's there, right? Does it still do that? I think so. I thought they stopped talking because now it's beeping. I guess maybe maybe I just stopped walking is what happened. <laughs> like, I haven't heard the um, <laughs> that go in a while. Yeah. Yeah, but, I yeah, I don't. I Oh. When I'm downtown, I don't use the crosswalk buttons, and that's the only place I ever walk, I guess. So, mm-hmm. yeah. Oh, it's making some sense. Mm-hmm. Um, I think we should just do the um, the 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 new background tape, ASAP. Oh, really? Okay, that's a good idea. The show's over. That's it. All yeah. right. All right we made it. Thanks for having me on the show. Thank you. Bye bye. I'll talk, talk to you later. Thanks for watching. It's Saturday. We're on TCTV, channel 22, 11:30 and 2 a.m. Check it out. Yeah, YHWM on YouTube. Three six zero three six three four. Calling matches you on TV. Yeah. WhatisWM.com, check it out!
Will Dowager, it's a good song, thank you. TCTV, La Baby, Jordy Fabulous, Orca Books, Four Star Video, Stop Spy Icon, Rebecca, Mountain Board, Northwest, Thurston County, Washington State, USA. Thank you, and viewers, it's you, you're watching, thank you. Hey, John, where are you? Call me. Hell yeah, Doc. Bye.